Welcome back to KPM Exceptional here in Landing, New Jersey. And it's early morning. We had a delivery this morning on our dock, not specifically for the holiday season, uh, and we really wanted to show you what it was. The staff here was so excited, we broke the, this unit out of the crate just to show you. So we've got two units here. They're both the Skag SFC30, the finish cut 30 inch mower. Um, but those who watched our GIE videos might notice an interesting little accessory on this one, and this is the unit that we broke out of the crate today. So this unit has swivel wheels on the front of it, okay? And this is something that's been asked about by many, many customers on this unit since day one. It's just been released, we, we, we announced it at GIE, but it's just been released and we wanted to show it to you. These are actually hitting the streets. Um, gonna be showing up in your dealer soon. So Skaggs Engineering actually developed this swivel wheel kit as an accessory. And that's important because I know the people watching this video that bought one last year that really wanted that extra maneuverability have been asking about it. And the answer is yes. If you bought one last year, this kit can be easily bolted up to the front of an existing SFC30, which is why we brought this unit to show you. This kit can be put on there or vice versa, and you're good to go. Also, in your Skag dealers, you're gonna see that the units can come either way, and your Skag dealer is likely to buy it uh, the way that works best for the landscapers in the area. Believe it or not, there are landscapers that love that configuration who are using this in certain uh, conditions, and then there's others who especially with the maneuverability on this, are gonna really prefer the swivel wheel kit. So we're gonna take this unit outside and we're not gonna actually cut grass with it because it's gonna cut exactly the same as the existing mower. And the hint here is it cuts exactly like a skag. Fantastic. One of the best, if not the best cutting 30 inch mower in the industry. Uh, so we're not gonna cut with it, but we are gonna take it outside and try out the caster wheel kit. I haven't tried this unit yet. This is the first day I'm even, even seeing it and getting my hands on it in, the, in our building. So we're gonna take it outside and we're gonna run it. I do wanna mention that availability on this will be springtime at your dealer. So if you're interested in it, especially with supply chain uh, considerations going on right now, make sure your dealer knows you're interested. And if you're super serious about it, maybe even put a deposit down on, on the swivel wheel kit or the full unit itself. Before we take these mowers outside, we just wanted to show you how this thing works without the engine even on. Check this out. Yeah, that's, that's really good because the unit isn't even on. So you get no assist from the engine. All right, so before we run this, I want to talk about a technique and this applies to both of these finish cut 30 inch mowers. It's going to seem like old hat probably to a lot of landscapers, but there's plenty of people, including myself, that really didn't know it. So here it is. When you're actually running this mower, and you need to turn it. This applies to swivel wheel kit or non. When you turn it, you wanna turn, say I'm turning left, you wanna turn with one hand while it's running inside. So if I'm turning right, I'm gonna use my right hand inside and I'm gonna turn it, okay? Don't use two hands. Now, I have a little uh, push behind mower that I use at home, tiny one, you know, homeowner unit, and I'm used to using two hands. You have to get out of that habit with this type of mower. All right, so you guys asked for it and Skag delivered yet again. Uh, the caster wheel kit on this SFC is uh, just what you we were looking for. It's way more maneuverable. Now I will say that it took me a couple of minutes to get used to it, but once I was used to it, it was like I had ran it my whole life. So for those of you that were looking for the extra maneuverability on your existing SFC, or were waiting until the kit came out to buy your SFC, now's the time. Mm -hmm. 